Hi everyone, it's me Darlene. I just want to let you know that I have my first upcycled shirt on eBay now and I do want to tell you a couple of things. When I made it, I had commented that I wish I wouldn't have used the orangey thread when I was putting in the elastic on the waist because it was zigzag so it was you know quite apparent that there was that zigzag line of stitching. Only took me minutes to undo that and redo it. I find using a seam ripper and ripping seams is very satisfying. I don't know why. I'm just weird. Leave me alone. <laughs> so I just wanted to show you now that the thread is clear so you don't see it on either side. And I also made it a little bit more gathered because I thought it just like looked gathered but not quite enough so now when the shirt is like opened oh it just drapes so nice I just love it so much I really like the way this came out I have new pictures on the eBay auction when you go to the auction always click on the big image that's on the top left and then it'll open up with really big images and you can scroll through then I also made just a very simple choker I also have a picture of the choker. It shows how it ties in the back, so it's adjustable. The smallest neck it will fit is 12 inches, which I think would be a child. And then, of course, it can just go to any size because you're just going to tie it. These are actually little natural bone beads. I have tons and tons of beads, all in packages, brand new, that I never used. And you also can wear it open in the front you tie your knot and you can let this hang like little jewelry I'm seeing that all the time that people are tying their chokers to the front so I just hope that uh, you go check out the auction even if you're not bidding on it I'd love for you to at least go see it and if you do bid I hope you win thanks so much for watching bye oh and all the measurements are listed so please take the time to look at the measurements I appreciate that